All right, folks, this is my custom symbiote Batman. It's not who we are underneath, but what we do that defines us. Now, this is my second rendition of the symbiote Batman figure. Um, actually, a customer had ordered this from me, and, you know, he wanted the Batman to, you know, look a little more modern day versus the classic, um, you know, with the yellow emblem and the yellow wings. So, I'd say this version looks a lot more realistic, real sinister. Kind of, you know, this is really how I imagine him appearing if the symbiote were to, you know, encounter the Batman. Maybe in, like, Web of Shadows or, you know, the whole city being overwhelmed by the symbiote invasion something like that but gave him some really crazy looking vampire teeth here I originally wasn't gonna give this guy eyes but I don't know it just seems to look a little better with some some eyes here and his ears of course have been lengthened up and the wings kinda have like a gray shade to him so he still sports like some of his classic gray costume and then, you know, he's gloss black with the blue sheen. And his crazy wrist forearm blades are lengthened up as well. And, of course, he wouldn't look, you know, he wouldn't be a symbiote Batman without some really terrorizing monster claws. The emblem is, you know, Dark Knight styled. And the belt, I decided to just go with um, kind of like a bat wrapping around his waist. Kind of looks pretty cool. But I guess you guys, um, let me know what you think about the new and improved symbiote Batman. And tell me, what symbiote character would you like to see next? <laughs> the comments with the most thumbs up will be the winner. <laughs>